What's up, guys? Hey, just want to show you my Father's Day present and subsequent project. Here we go. Plus, yeah, I've been waiting for this little goodie. Once I get this thing set up, I'll be able to set my sails while the boat's steering itself. Maybe take a break and read a book for a while. So here I'm sorting out where exactly to mount the Raymarine ST1000. First thing I need to do is get the tiller straight. So I use the tamer here and got the two lines to be identical in length. And then I know that I'm dead center on the tiller. The so. pivot point of the rudder marked 18 inches out from the pivot point. And the S Marine 1000 is right here at 23 and a quarter inches. So, so I don't want to mount it to the seat, mainly because I want to be able to put the cushion back on it. So I'm going to put the pin on the gunnel here and um, use an extension to get to the tiller. I came off perpendicular to the tiller to find this spot, which I measured at 31 and a quarter inches. So now um, all I need to get is an extension for the, uh, the tiller part here. This actually unscrews. And for about 50 bucks, Ray Merlin sells the extension to bring it out the eight inches that I need to make up that distance up on it. And I just happen to have this piece of galvanized pipe with a three inch thread. And I tried it out and lo and behold, it fits. So if this length is good, then all I need to do is get a three eighth coupling to put the plastic tip back on. Uh, Ray Marine wants you to reinforce the area where that pin sleeve is going to be going through the gunnel. So uh, I've got this three quarter inch piece of plywood, Baltic birch. Uh, I'm gonna cut it down to fit inside there and then epoxy it in. So there it is. I made it three inches across the top because I put a tape measure in there. And then it kind of roughly got about three inches. So we'll get this one out. Yeah, this one. slap in there but I don't care about that I just gotta figure out a way to hold it in place man I think I need to beat down more Just drill the hole in the tiller, and I went so that it's plumb, not perpendicular to the tiller, because I wanted it straight up and down. For the unit, and this is how I installed the pivot point on the back. Put two screws into the wood that's epoxied underneath the gunnel here. And my electrical, I decided to put back there. I just wanted to be able to clear this and I didn't want it to be in the way of the cushion that's not here right now, but first day solo sailing. She's on the ramp. I just took the straps off. There she is, she's ready to go. Well, I gotta put the rudder on first. And we're sailing. Into the wind. Pull the mainsail out. The wind just picked up. We're doing five and a half knots. It's awesome. Beautiful. 65 degrees. And ask for a better day. Awesome day. Cruising along. Good old time. Get the autopilot doing his job over there. And this is just fucking awesome. That autopilot just stepped this baby up 
A thousand percent. That's all I got to say about that. Gives me a chance to do a little house cleaning in here. Need something. Work on my log. Good company. back data point it's been an awesome day but it's Sunday I'm gonna go out for work tomorrow